Uh, this is Dari. Today, uh, I'm going to show you quickly how to do the dynamically diagram. Uh, if you see that point move back and forth here, how to do that? Because I saw many tutorials or many diagrams recently in LinkedIn, in internet in general, use that kind of style in diagram. So I'm going to show you how to do that first. Uh, you can get the same diagram from uh, AWS or you can do the same technique in any diagram. So, but let's follow this very quick or follow the same similar to that. So you go here, uh, just write AWS icon uh, PowerPoint and you go, you can go to the, uh, the first link here. So if you go to this website, you can easily download the PowerPoint here because this diagram, all these activities can do in PowerPoint and should be PowerPoint 2019 above, uh, which is come up, come up with the uh, Office 365 uh, as well. So here you can download the dark background here. And after download that background, you can find it here. I have here. So this diagram in front of you, I'm going to show you how to do this kind of things, the technique then maybe after that you can do in any diagram you want. So first of all, you wanted to get the shape here. So I go with this circle here. So I just put it circuit here very quick. This circle here. Uh, and I put it here in the middle. <coughs> okay. So this one, it's when you click on it. Uh, very simple, you can go to uh, uh, animations, as you can see here. So animation here, you can choose anyone, but the important thing, the pa path animation here. So in the path animation, you can step by step, put whatever any path you want, but is easy way you can go with the draw, uh, free draw like this, draw free from to where. So simply here, you can one click here. I don't know if I can make it zoom a little bit. Yes. So if you see here, I can go one click here. Then I go down. Then when I put it here, one click again, then I just move smoothly to the right. Then when I click at the end here, just make sure it's then after that, go to the up as well. One click once finish, just double click. So as you can see, is moving back and forth here. If you want it back and forth, sorry, this is just want to go from left to right. So double click on it and you can I just go back to the same little here. Double click here or click to the number one. As you can see here, you can see more option here. You can add another, but I just wanted to show you something here. You can do uh, if you go to effect option in the effect option here you can do auto reverse that is helpful if you go here you can rem review so if you go here they back and forth here to the same way that good as well so as well if you want time you go here time then maybe you can go duration is just as slow then tested i want to click to see that kind of thing is good once when done here, of course, you can put it in any diagram you want. This is just example. You need to save this page as a .gif. So first I wanted to copy or cut this page, then delete it all because I don't want it to change all the file as a GIF, only one page here. So I just put it the page here. And again, make sure it's work just very quick, as you can see here. Then once it's work, you can save it, go to the file. If you use Microsoft uh, uh, Windows, you can save by save as and pick the format or file format dot GIF. But in Mac OS, a little bit different. You can go to export In the export here. You can put the name here, say test. And rather than PDF, you can just change it to animated GIF, as you can see here. So keep everything default here, just export here. Final result after save. So this is the file here. So this is the file, right click and open with 
you can pick any browsing here internet browser like for example Firefox or Google so the result will be uh, like this I hope this quick tutorials informative for you thank you for watching